and now Branch and she VA Health. Um, my husband and I are 35 year residents of uh, San Clemente, and I'm here to express my concern and opposition to the PCA proposal to extend the state route to the 241 and run it basically through two historic communities of San Juan and San Clemente. I have lived here my entire life. I do not want to move. My home is situated in between the proposed 17 and the proposed 14. I want to raise my kids in San Clemente, the place that I grew up, the town that I call home. My husband and I are very active in the community. We coach San Clemente Little League for the last four years now with our son. My other son swims at the Aquatic Center, plays at the park. He's only four years old. He has a little, some health issues. We're still discerning what is going on with him. But running a toll road over a park where hundreds of children play, swim, baseball, soccer, run, football, you name it. Every sport is played at that park that we just spent millions of dollars to build for our children. And we're gonna run a toll road over it. How is that healthy for our kids and the next generation of our children? I don't understand why we cannot wait to establish alternate roads after the I-5 has been constructed and it's been completed. And if you really need to, a toll road to get to San Diego to dinner, or you do, then consider connecting the 241 with the 15, bringing it down to Route 78 or 76. And if the real problem is going north and south, then take east-west roads and make those public roads better. But use the toll road to handle high traffic inland and higher traffic to San Diego and connect those to the back of 78. The city of San Clemente is not responsible for the traffic jams of San Diego. Um, after seeing some of the evidence at the June 5th meeting and talking to some of my friends of what happened to them and their First Amendment rights being violated, and I think the woman that came up and had the guts to speak out about what happened to her. Because I don't know if I would have handled it the same way. So I thank you for that and your courage. It was supposed to be a fair and balanced forum. And from my perspective and many others, it was not that. The TCA, you're only adding fuel to our fire. The city of San Clemente, the city of San Juan, we will not back down. We will only get stronger. We see you in our hills. We see you around town. We know these people, and we know your, corrupt, your corruption and lies that you've already been trying to pull over us. You are now against three cities. That's many constituents who have voted for you, and that you have the responsibility to act, and you work for us. So I have said that earlier today. You thank work thank for you us. very much. Thank, thank you. you.